what is going on ladies and gents broken mike here and welcome back to the channel and today we are back with some more wwe 2k20 and of course this is buw episode 31 the fallout from broken dreams so of course if you missed broken dreams then please please do make sure to go and check those parts out there is a playlist so Feel free to check that out. So, we've got another, another action-packed episode of BW for you tonight. We've got three championship matches and a tag team championship main event. That will be absolutely mouth-watering. And I hope you'll be able to tune into that in part four when the Ginger Dead Men look to win back their BW tag team titles from... The shift. Can they do it? So, let's just dive into the action. So, of course, as you can see, we're going to be kicking off the show with the Aussie Outbackers, Aussie and Corey, taking on Wes and Jess of the Broken Psychos, my brothers in arms. Of course, Jesse, the US champion still, after retaining against Will. And Wes, who became the new WWE champion against Parker. So this is going to be a very interesting matchup, to say the least. So if you do enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like for Mike. Leave some comments down below. And please, please do make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And tap that post notification bell. <clears throat> So here we go again, folks, live once again from the famous Blackpool Tower in England. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 441 pounds. Listen to this crowd, guys. So here come the Aussie Outbackers, folks. And look at Corey sporting some new gear. Corey and Ozzy who have had individual success when it comes to winning championships but they've never once had a shot at the tag team titles a win over the psychos and they could put themselves up there So here come my brothers in arms, Jesse, the United States Champion, and where's the new WWE Champion? Of course, uh, our fellow Broken Psycho, Lucas Hackett, will be defending his Hardcore Championship later on in the evening against RC in an Extreme Rules match. And things are looking pretty rosy for the broken psychos right now. So okay, looks like it's gonna be Ozzy and Wes starting off for their respective teams. And here we go. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get And Wes who has uh, found his confidence once again in recent weeks. Now he's uh, WWE Champion. Of course, previously had a bit of a rut after two runs with the Global Championship. Of 
in off the tag. Jesse with the blind tag. Ozzy with a side Russian leg sweep to Jesse. Ozzy out backers with a thing to prove. But... And I said a win against the Psychos and that will definitely go a long way. And Ozzy taking it to the uh, US champion. Corey makes the tag. Now how is Corey's confidence right now after... He come one man shy in, cha in challenging for that U.S. championship. Of course, uh, fell short in that battle royal a few weeks ago. Wes is now the legal participant for the Psychos. And the hammerlock from Corey. Hooked up in a pump handle. Pump handle net breaker. That was nasty. Knee strike to the face. Fury with these attacks. Just producing an onslaught. Reverse suplex. Where's caught the foot? Belly to belly suplex. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the both uh, Corey and Wes on the outside. And there's that stunt puller. The tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent. If it's Raw or SmackDown. Wesley and Corey evenly fall between these two young, uh, superstars. Wes, one of the, one of the uh, most experienced superstars in a BW locker room. Championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. Comes in off the tag. And there's a, a tag to Ozzy, and we're going to get a double team here. Oh, Shot to the ribs. Devastating elbow. And Ozzy taking it to uh, the WWE Champion, and Wes was able to make the tag to Jesse. And there's a clothesline. Yeah, but think of all the energy this is how you start a show, ladies and gentlemen. Four of B&W's finest right here in the middle of this ring. This is how people end up getting hurt. Snake heist there was he. Jesse dragging, dragging him away from the ropes. Cover. Just a one count. That's all right, Cole. And there's a super kick from Jesse. Is this enough for the win here? There's a two and Corey in time to uh, save the matchup for the Outbackers. In comes Wesley. Mr. Woos. Kick to the stomach. Ozzy fights free. Ozzy hits a crucifix. Working on the right arm of the WWE Champion. Ozzy with a barrage of elbow strikes to... Uh, Mr. Woos. Ozzy gets sent over the top but lands on the apron. Oh, Ozzy! Hung, hangs out Wesley to dry. In comes Corey. Corey, a former United Kingdom champion here in BUW. Quick tag back to Ozzy. There's a back elbow. Ozzy, who's a four-time Intercontinental Champion. Corey back in. Nice teamwork here from the Aussie Outbackers. Quick tags. 
keeping each other fresh. Vertical suplex. Corey has Wesley by the throat. And there's a shot right to the stomach. Knee strike. Ozzy back in in a double team. Where's counters? And there's a single leg drop kick. Jesse tagged in. And double team for the Psychos now. Double axe handle on the uh, left arm of Ozzy. Now I'll make you the limbs go numb. Oh, hang on a second, cover. And Ozzy barely kicking out. There's a PDJ. Is this it for the Psychos? No, it isn't. Ozzy kicks out of the PDJ. Not many people have kicked out of that move. Ozzy can say he's one of those few people that have. Ozzy trying to crawl to his corner. And in comes Corey. And Jesse catches Corey with a drop kick. There's a right hand. Jess seems to. Oh, I was going to say Jess seemed to be one uh, step ahead of Corey, but Corey hits a knee lift. There's another one. There's a drop kick to Corey. Jesse going to the top rope. We don't usually see him fly. No one home. He fluffed his lines. He's going to try for it again. Swanton bomb. We haven't seen Jesse do that ever. And a near fall. I don't think I'll ever recall seeing Jesse hitting a Swanton bomb in his time in BW. There's a shot to the ribs of Jesse. Of course, Ozzy now the legal man. Shots to the, to the spine of the US champion. Springboard, no one. No, Ozzy caught him. Ozzy Atbacker is looking impressive here tonight. Can they pick up a big win here? Jess counters. There's a super kick and Ozzy, I believe, has been busted open. Cover. And Corey again saves the match for, for his team. And there's the head and neck crank. And there's that vintage backbreaker from uh, Jesse. There's a back suplex. Ozzy driving the knee. Zigzag. That could be it. But Ozzy doesn't doesn't go for the cover. That's a huge error on his part. 
No one home there. Olympic slam from Jesse. He's got him covered. Into the cover. And Aussie again. Barely kicking out after two. There's an Enziguri. And Jess has been knocked for a loop. And Jess is going for that reverse Boston Crab. Corey again making the save. Jesse again, top row. Looking for the fish drop, but Ozzy rolls out the way. Corey tag back in. There's a shot to the ribs. There's a knee strike. Jesse needs to make a tag to Wesley. Cover. Oh, and that could have been free if it wasn't for Wesley. And what is Corey going for here? DDT. Oh my goodness. Jesse somehow kicks out. And I think Jess has actually been busted open as well. And I like this new aggression from Corey. And there's a knee strike. There's a super kick. The juggernaut's down. Oh! How close can you get? What's coming next? Taking their time. Of course, Corey's still angry at himself that he didn't win that battle royal a couple of weeks ago to earn a US title match. Pump handle net breaker. And much, much needed tag for Wes, to, for Jesse. He was in there any longer, I think that could have been it for the Psychos. And there's a back suplex, cover. And this time, Ozzy saving the match. There's the elbow strikes. Mr. Woos, is he closing in on another victory? There's a super kick. Not going for the cover. He's dishing out more punishment to Corey. And then comes Ozzy. Can Ozzy and Corey get a big win here? Ozzy with a super kick. He's in full control now. Back suplex. Oh, float over into the net breaker. What a way to kick the show off, folks. A five-star tag team bat a match. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. Of course, it is a battle as well. What a counter. Counter for counter, hole for hole between these four superstars. Unfreaking believable. I do not know what I'm trying to say, folks. I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. And this is only the first match of the of the night. Wesley struggling to pull himself to his feet. Switching music. Falls right into the cover. But Wes was too near the ropes. Oh no. Curb stomp. He's not going for the cover. Instead, he's going to let Corey pick up the pieces. 
Boy's gonna get the glory, guys. What a knee strike. That is ball game, folks. No, it isn't. And Corey cannot believe. Oh, here we go. Corey's law. That is ball game for sure. Oh, that would have been free if it wasn't for Jesse. This aggression from Corey is unreal. And he's got a hold locked in. Is Wes going for a nap? He probably would have done if Jesse hadn't saved his backside. Oh, there's a strike. And Corey's now busted open. I think everyone's busted open apart from Mr. Woos. This match is going to be tough to beat, I tell you. Oh, no. Wesley. No way. No way. Not the Mr. Green from up there. No! Unreal. It's over. It is over. No! Corey! I heard three. Corey, how? Corey, oh, I don't believe it. Corey kicked out of a second rope, Mr. Green. And look at the blood trickling down his face. Oh, man. This new side of Corey is unbelievable. Where has this Corey been? Has this Corey been deliberately been locked away all this time? Un unfreaking real, folks. Wes goes crashing into the stairs. Corey's a changed man, that's for sure. Wesley sends Corey back into the ring. There's a right hand to come back is on. Knee smash. Back suplex. Is this it? Referee out of position. Old referee gets bundled down. Jesse with an exploder. And Wes going for the finale. Mr. Gree. That's lights out. Aussie's nowhere to be seen. And the Psychos win. But I am a loss for words. What an epic match between these two teams. Oh man. At one point, on numerous occasions, you thought the Outbackers had this match, and I must say, I like this new attitude of Corey a whole lot. As I say, that, that side of Corey, I, I swear that's been laying dormant for a long time. Can I, can we see more of that, Corey, please? Fanta but fantastic win for the Psychos. Don't take anything away. What a match to start the show off, folks. What a match. Next up. we got some singles action.
and it's going to be King Dominator and he's going to be taking on the former IC champion Dan Danger of course last time out King Dominator picked up a massive win against the former United States champion Liam Robinson can he get a win over another former champion can you get a win over the former intercontinental champion King Dominator has had some mixed fortunes in his career in BUW. Has got some big wins and has had some setbacks too. Had uh, shots at the uh, Global Championship and Hardcore Championship. But on those occasions he fell short to capture the title. But hey, we do what we have to do. He picked up a much needed confidence boosting win over the former US champion Liam Robinson on the Go Home Show a couple of weeks back. And his opponent from Leeds, England, weighing in at 252 pounds. Guys, this match is sure to And speaking not of superstars who need a confidence boosting win, you can't look past this man. Dan Danger has not had the best of fortunes over the last number of months. Hasn't won too many matches. And he wants to get back up that ladder and back where he feels he belongs. And that is in title contention. Of course, this man was once the BUW Intercontinental Champion. And he would love to at least get an opportunity to get back there. And guys, I hate to say it, but sometimes it's win over the King Dominator. Could, put him, could do just that. So a first time ever meeting between these two superstars. And here we go. These guys are undoubtedly going to get Dominator coming out strong. Did you hear the impact? A European uppercut. Great agility there. Dan with the counter. Dangerous situation here, guys. Downright treacherous. Oh. Moves and there's a du double feet uh, of uh, King Dominator and follows up with a crucifix. Look at this. This match has a backbreaker. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. And the former IC champion is getting literally dominated. No pun intended, folks. He's in non-stop attack mode. Great reversal. I got to Dan trying to fight back his way into the match. Dan's not a small individual. There's a drop kick. Sends Dominator to the outside. There's a knee to the head and neck of... Uh, Dan Danger. Piercing. Oh, 
Up and... One man flat jack. And what's Dominator going to do here? There's a monkey flip. Snap me a tag down. Now bow to the face. Things are not looking good for him right now. Saw that one Dan with the right hand, trying to fight what his way back. There's a Michinoku driver. Quick ten attempt here. Into the cover. Very curious. Not even a one count. At this point, he can withstand a lot more punishment. I can promise you that. There's a takedown. Into the chin lock. Dan fighting his way free. There's a left hand to the uh, stomach. Net breaker to uh, to Dan. He's looking for the super kick. No, oh no, he got it that time. Is this it? Just a one count. And Dominator is shocked, to say the least. Oh no. Looking for the future shock. But Dan Danger manages to counter. And there's, there's the slam. This could be big. Another face buster. European uppercut. Dominator drops, drops the elbow. And now there's another monkey flip. He is efficient and dangerous with his offense thus far. Nothing is going to stop him now. Dominator driving the uh, knee into the face of Dan Danger. Uh oh, submission move. Danger in a whole heap of trouble. Just can't really get any momentum going. That, that move did not even knock Dominator down. And there's a dominal stretch locked in here. No danger gets free from that. From, from that uh, from that submission. And look at this. What a Uranagi from Dan. Into the cover. And Dan only gets a two count. Irish whip. Dan making, trying to make the most of this opportunity. There's a kick. He's not done yet. There's another kick. And a barrage of kicks to the face of Dominator. And that could be it for the big man. No, it isn't. Dan again coming so close. Going with the German suplex. And whoa, Michael, what a lariat. Inside out. Cover. Oh! And Dan coming with an eyelash of getting that win. He really really needs he's trying again he's going for it a second time doing whatever it takes to win and there it is again cover but two near the ropes dominator's foot under the ropes i don't know where dan's finding this adrenaline 
dominated counters. And also, I think he's been busted open. And the comeback's on, folks. Sling blade. Nezo, oh my god, what a boot. Sings Dominator across the ring. Goes into the cover. Oh, that, oh, was that free? The referee says no. And there's a power bomb. No, kick out. And the submission's locked in. And Dan has to tap. But what a match. What an effort. Here's a few clips from the last match with. What a wrestling match. I wouldn't mind seeing seeing these two go at it again. That was a fine effort from both men. Fine effort. At the end of the day, it's King Dominator who gets the victory. Here is your winner, King the Dominator. Nicely done. Picking up the win here. When you bring such a high level of intensity to the match, good things are bound to happen to you. As we close the book on this match, so there you go, folks. King Dominator pins the former Intercontinental Champion amazing. and gets back to back wins. So, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to leave this part here. So, hopefully, you all enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure to hit the like for Mike. Leave some comments down below and please do make sure to subscribe if you haven't already done so. And make sure that little notification bell is switched on. So of course I am your host for this one Broken Mike. Don't you dare go anywhere because we've got plenty more action from this action packed episode of BW still to come. So we'll be back in a little bit with part two. So I will see you all there.